Hey guys, and we're back. When we left off, Link took a massive turn, and we are on it. And this is what's left. Link has been eating nothing but fish and meat, and this is, this is how he is now. Oh my god. Wow, it's loud. Okay, we cannot go up there. I understand that this is an investigation of the ruins, but Janto is coming into contact with all kinds of dangerous things. I wish he would show a little more caution during his research. Ruins? Oh. Right, do you see that opening there? Uh. The cliff crumbles as a result of the upheaval and that revealed these ancient ruins. Prince Sidon immediately ordered a thorough investigation. Mm, Janto is a historian, so this kind of thing is his speciality. He was terribly excited and is completely transfixed by the ruins. Let's go! What can be done? We simply cannot read the text properly so long as the stone slate is broken as much as I wish it were not so. How grateful I would be if the missing fragment of the slate were to surface somewhere. Um, well, if it crumbled, shouldn't it be here? Somewhere? Is there a recall? Can I recall something? No. Let me call that back into the sky. Come on, Link. Come on, Link. Let's go. Let's go. What is that? Holy shit! It looks like it's getting further away as we get closer. Even. What the hell is that? Dude, it's the Borg! Man, I didn't know this freaking game had Star Trek in it. Dude, Link, jump straight! What the hell? So we need some water. <coughs> that didn't do 
anything. What are we supposed to do here? Floating Scales Island. the top. I don't really want to waste all my stuff. Maybe we clear off the back and just see what's up here. <coughs> Nothing. This is weird. Okay. Why would they just have an island with nothing on it? Gales Island, huh? Guys, look what else I just found. It's our boy. <laughs> wow. There's a tower, but there's another tower down there. Okay. So, I'm gonna investigate here a little more. I think we might have to go back and talk to Robbie or whoever's in charge. Because wasn't there, um... Uh, what's it called? Um, um, somebody working on slate somewhere in, in this Terry Town or whatever it's called. I'm not Terry Town. No. Oh shit! Oh my gosh, I need some like sludge boots or something. Uh, whatever the little starter town is, I forget. I forgot the name of it. Can we surface somewhere? Oh my gosh, what is that? It's right there! Oh, we can't get out of the sludge, okay. Alright, we got this. Boom! We the best. <gasps> what is this? Stone slate? It, it can hardly believe my eyes. Link, I must thank you. Ah! Ah, incredible. I can finally read it. Yes, very well, I can. Stand up, or stand upon the land of the sky fish. And behold its lofty view. Among the floating rocks, you see a droplet waits for you. Through this droplet, shoot an arrow with the mark of the king. Do this task, and you shall reveal the most wondrous thing. See the watery bridge is resting spot with your own eyes, that which connects the Zora to the people of the skies. <laughs> This is extraordinary discovery. It's important text. It actually tells us how to journey into the sky. Mm. Hmm. Though in truth, that mystery just leads us straight into another. One difficult has been overcome and yet another has appeared in its wake. Mm. As it mentions the mark of the king, perhaps this would be prudent to consult King Dorfin. I assume that he will be returning from his investigation of the sludge shortly. Okay, so we gotta talk to the king. New objective. Okay, Jonas is just speaking with the king about the mark. Okay, so back to the king. Back to the king, guys. Here we go. Alright, to the king! Dun, dun, dun. Let me know if you like the jump cuts or not. I mean, all you really miss me doing is climbing a ladder and teleporting. So. Uh, isn't this where the king sits? The king. Oh man, King Dorfin, super punch and super kick. Ha ha! I'm so big and strong. Wah ha ha! Oh no, I got beat. 
the sludge was too was so yucky. Ah, oh, you got me, you big dumb monster. There is no other choice. I have to hide in a secret spot, and that spot is. Hmm. What up, guy? We're full up on folks who are allowed to play in our King Dorphin's game. We can't keep playing with you here, so take a hint and scram. Can I sneak? Oh. The hiding is. Mm. Hmm. What up, guy? Ah. Um. Oh. Well, when I was cleaning the throne room, the children shooed me away. They declared that they were playing a secret game, insisting, uh. vehemently and the adults are not allowed so I did something interesting about their little game though I, oh I did hear something interesting about their little game though. Oh. they are uh, allegedly pretending to be King Dorfin once more it seems they are recreating recent events it is ill advised to allow them to mess around there over there as an adult i must participate i mean watch over them uh the question is how do i sneak a peek i wonder if there's somewhere i could hide that's exactly what i'm doing. Sludge is too thick and gross. I have failed. My king, King Dorfin. Oh, pretty please. Oh, uh. What if you went to that one place to hide? Hey, come on. Do it right. That, that didn't sound like him at all. I'm trying, but I can't play Muzu and the monster. Not by myself. Hey, I've been wondering forever. The secret spot where King Dorfin is hiding. What kind of place is it? <laughs> I know, right? I was asked King Dorfin about it once. Um, he said it was a pristine sanctu uh, <laughs> sanctumy, sanctumy, <laughs> or something. Oh. Uh, pristine sanctumy. So I guess it is a spot with clear water. Somewhere you can get your tummy clean and stuff. Oh my god, this is why I can't read. <laughs> uh, but these days, most of the water around the domain is yucky because of the sludge. Ooh. Oh, I've heard there's clear water flowing somewhere between Palamos Mountain and the domain. And there's supposed to be a secret entrance behind the waterfall too. Mm. How cool is that? Oh. A secret entrance behind the waterfall with clear water, huh? That sounds pretty amazing. Oh. Lou told us we could never tell anyone. Oh. It's fine, no one's listening. <laughs> Anyways, let's go through the game again. It's time, okay. <sighs> it's time for the feeling. Oh, I can't replay something else. Behind clear waterfall, somewhere between Palm and the... Okay. So it's directly behind the domain, right? So, we either have to enter through here, or here. Wait, 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 what? Hold on. Polymus Mountain and the Domain. Polymus Mountain. Map. Polymus Mountain. Polymus Mountain and the Domain. 
Oh, okay. So it's up here somewhere. Or in here. Shatterback Point. Well, we got two spots to go, right? We'll travel to Meepa's Court and work our way down. Meepa's Court. Okay, so... Directly behind us... Ah! Stupid yuck. Alright, so there's waterfalls all down here. What is this guy doing? Pretending to be King Dorfin for fun, but you know, whatever I bring them some fish, boom, they stop what they're doing. Uh, King Dorfin? That's right, they're playing through our beloved king. All I heard was something about sludge and uh. monsters. Seems like a strange game to be honest. <laughs> Just grateful they can play in the throne room. That means I don't have to worry about them. Let's get some fishies while we're at it. Not this one? <laughs> okay, so it's not that one. Alright. Let's consult our adventure log again. Behind a clean waterfall. Somewhere between Palmas Mountain and the Domain. Well, that's where we are. And they're all clean waterfalls. Right? Maybe it's this one? Is it? No, I don't follow oh. Him. Portal! Get out who approaches! It's you! So it's you, Link! Hmm? How did you find this place? What cruel ploy are you plotting? <laughs> hold my ever loyal. Uh, hold! My ever loyal Muzu! If you speak in such a way without explanation, Link here will only be confused as to what is going on. Poor guy. <coughs> ah. Hello, Link. It has been some time since we last spoke. I received word that you went missing along with Princess Zelda. Why have you come here? To help you guys. Look at you. You're a mess. <laughs> well, well. To think that such a thing should transpire for a hero of Hyrule and Princess Zelda. Huh? You expect us to believe that Princess Zelda simply disappeared just like that? Do you sully our ears with your lies? This guy is always such a dick to us. God. Uh, I saw Princess Zelda with my own eyes right after the phenomenon at Hyrule Castle took place. Hmm. Calm yourself, Muzu. Link's eyes betray no hint of deception. He remains a trusted friend of the Zora. There must be an explanation. Link, I will now tell you what happened when uh, we last saw Princess Zelda, as well as the reason behind my seclusion here in the pristine sanctum. We encountered Princess Zelda just after Hyrule Castle ascended into the sky. Floating islands appeared it from nowhere. Sludge and fragments of the ruins began raining down. Muzu and I left the domain to investigate these strange occurrences. That's when it happened. Princess Delta descended from the sky, accompanied by a sludge monster. What happened next took us by surprise. 
Then she unleashed the beast upon us. Uh. King Dorfin, uh, man, violently vanquished the threat. However, he was gravely injured by the sludge during the battle. As for Prince Princess Zelda, she vanished without a trace. Uh. If word got out that Princess Zelda lost her mind and harmed Zora King, the resulting turmoil would be devastating. That's why we have temporarily, uh, temp that's why we are temporarily hiding within the pristine sanctum. <coughs> According to your story, Princess Zelda disappeared sudden suddenly in the depths beneath Hyrule Castle. Oh, on the other hand, she suddenly appeared near Zora's domain and unleashed a monster upon us. The waters of uh, truth have become murkier still, but from the Zora's perspective, one thing is clear. Hmm. It all leads back to the sky. Oh. This disaster, the sludge, the monster, even Princess Zelda. It may well be the answer to these riddles. Uh, to these riddles can be found skyward. Hmm. Sidon ordered Janto, a historian well um, acquainted with ruins, to investigate. I wonder if any progress has been made. <laughs> ah, so you've already spoken with Janto. You say that the mark of the king was mentioned in the stone slate that was restored. Hmm, indeed, I do know of it. Yes, the mark of the king refers to Zora's king's scale. One of my scales, in other words. Oh. I have returned. Uh, uh, I have heard it called by the name you mentioned in ancient ritual. However, none remaining who know how it is used. Uh, if this particular scale of mine may prove useful to you, by all means take a few. Uh, there is no need for restraint. This is a. This is nothing to me. If you run out, simply return to acquire more. <laughs> okay. <sighs> after all that has transpired, and after much reflection, I have come to a realization. I must truly be getting on in years and have allowed a mere monster to catch me off guard. Perhaps it is time... Perhaps the time is near, nearing for me to pass the title of King to Sidon. Uh, king Dorfin? Hmm. In any case, that is a matter for another day, after the chaos surrounding the sludge has quieted. Please inform Sidon about my situation and about the King's scale. Tell him there is no need to worry about me. Tell him that he must go forth, do what he needs to be done. Oh, it's about to get real. All right, so we're gonna fast travel up to King Sidon. Be right back. And we're back. We're about to hang out with our boy, soon to be King Sidon. We're skipping. Oh, ah, that is a that is Zora armor. Yeah, buddy. It's really perfect on you. I have no doubt that it will help you search for Princess Zelda. Yes! Speaking of, have you found anything? Dude, we found all the <clears> things. <throat> what do you say, my father was attacked by a monster? <sighs> and Princess Zelda unleashed it upon him? What could that possibly mean? Well, for now, I fear all we can do is take my father at his words and try not to let our concerns overcome us. Mm -hmm. Link, thank you for telling me about my father. Hmm. Princess Zelda descending from the sky, not to mention the monster and the filthy sludge. It seems our course is skyward. Well, now known that the mark of the king written on the slate refers to my father's scale, the only remaining mystery is that of the land of the skyfish and the floating rock in the shape of a droplet. Stand upon the land of the skyfish that must be referred to an actual location of some sort. I am sure that if we locate the land of the skyfish, it will lead us to the floating rock that is shaped of a droplet. Link, if you if you find any leads, please let me know at once. Hmm. 
Guys, we've already figured this out. We've already figured this out. Okay. So check it out. We go to our map, land of the sky fish, go to our uh, sky, boom, floating scale islands, land of the sky fish. All right, so now we need to get back up there. Um, how did we get up there last time? Uh, I'll be right back, I'll get us there. All right, there is a rock that just fell. Uh, we can return with that or hear me out. Oh shit, there's a thing there. Um, shit. Um, I'm gonna try to glide over to this waterfall. Yes, it worked. Piece of cake. Floating steel island. Okay. Oh my god, that doesn't work. Ugh. Okay. There's a droplet, right? Okay, adventure log. Okay, so stand upon the land of the skyfish and behold its lofty view. Among the floating rocks, you see a droplet waits for you. Through this droplet, shoot an arrow with the mark of the king. Do this and shall reveal the most wondrous thing. Through the droplet. Okay, so there's a droplet up here. <gasps> there's a droplet right there. Oh my gosh, right in front of us. Okay, so we'll do this. Okay, let's not, let's not do that. I can't believe we just accidentally found this. Okay, so, sort, 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 um, king scale. There it is. Oh, we are doing this, finally. Sidon. Okay. Well, it's on the way, so we'll just fly down Sidon. Why has it got to be nighttime every time I try to film? Come on now. Should we do a campfire real quick? Let's do a campfire. Uh, we need one of these. And a flint right here. There we go. We will drop it. Wait until morning. Morning. And we're back. It's morning. Oh, look, Sidon and his girly friend. Soon to be the queen. Lady Yona. Mm. Lady Yona, it's far too dangerous for you to be here. Yes. Darling, I came here because there is something I need to speak with you about. I have been thinking for quite a, some time. Oh, hello there, Lee. Huh? What's happened, my friend? Did you figure something out? Uh. You solved an ancient stone slate uh, riddle, it, uh, um, <laughs> riddle, and a pillar of light appeared. The worlds upon the stone slate are correct. The path to the sky may open up if we investigate that location. Oh, well done, Link. This is a huge development. I see. My dear Sidon, thank you. You should go with Link as inv to investigate the Pillar of Light. As I will just, uh, just about to say, uh, for a long time I have been concerned that you are holding yourself back and not acting as freely as you would have expected. But my love, 
if you and Link join your powers, I am certain you shall be able to overcome whatever danger awaits. Hmm. It is undoubtedly true, however. Uh? Whatever is troubling you, Sidon, why are you hesitating so? Hmm. It's simply that... Oh, shit. Uh? Huh? I got this. A monster is covered in sludge. Mm. Could it be the foul beast that harmed father? Mm. Sighted. We can take care of the water, at least for a little while. Do not fret about the domain. Yeah. Huh. You're right. As ever, it is up to you, my lady. Mm. Link, please. I must ask you to fight by my side once more. Well, yeah, you know I got your back, boy. The beast is protecting its body with sludge. Uh, this might be uh, this mighty opponent certainly, but we must not falter. When an opportunity presents itself, call out to me. Okay. I shall use my power to envelop you in water, uh, thusly shielding you from your foes. At this point, you may shoot forth the water as an attack by swinging the weapon. Sidon's power of water. When Sidon's aura is charged, he can create a bubble of water that blocks incoming attacks. If you swing your weapon, the water will be channeled into a long range strike. We need to get up close and personal with him. Be careful. Okay, let's uh, clear some trap out of the way here then. <laughs> Food. It's time for some food. What do we need? What do we need? Should we do our defense up? Nah, let's just eat some regular fruit. We have to remove the sludge somehow. Oh shit. Oh my god, where's my bow? Dude. Oh my god, Prince Sighted. I'm sorry, bro. You'll be all right. Okay, let's see a defense up. We got like three of them. Run out of these fruit. Ones. Yeah. Oh, Sidon, let's go. Got him. I say we just use this piece of crap up. Let's do it.
do it, brothers! Brothers and all, let's go! You did it, Link! Take that, full beast of the sludge. Foul piece of the sludge. Is everything alright? Oh yeah, now we're just chilling. Just chilling. Well, we are unarmed. <clears throat> Thank goodness. Lady Yona, if something happened to you, I... I... Um, uh, I it, in any case, it is... Uh, it is possible that another monster will appear. I suggest that you return to the domain at once. Thank you for the sentiment, Sidon. However, more importantly, we must consider what Sir Link spoke of earlier. That pillar of light that he said appeared uh, at the reservoir belongs, uh, be, <laughs> begs to be investigated. This may be our opportunity to learn the cause of the sludge falling from the sky, or even Princess Zelda's whereabouts. Yes! Leave this place to us. Dearest Sidon, your friend needs your help getting to the bottom of this mystery. This is going to be an awesome power to have, by the way. I like this one. Uh, well, of course, it will be the best for me to accompany him. However, I cannot leave you alone in this dangerous place. Did you not entrust the task to us already? We will not be on our own for long. We shall be just fine. But, Sidon, my darling, I truly appreciate that you worry so for my safety. Uh, it speaks of the kindness in your heart. But you are the prince of the Zora. One day you will lead the people you, <laughs> of your beloved domain. You can see right through. I can see right through you whenever you want me to or not. You are yielding to the fear of losing someone you love again. You must overcome your past and face whatever the future holds with courage. Mm -hmm. But I... Come now. Enough is enough. Oof. You are not acting like yourself. Hey now. You must leave this place to me. Sweet Sidon, do not get lost in the past. You must keep moving ever onward. Just follow your heart as you always do. Like my old self, like I always do. Yes, yes! <laughs> Is that all right? I swear, I am not going anywhere. I see, and that is clear as day. <laughs> I was giving into my fear of once more losing someone I love. I... <laughs> ah! Ah! You are right, Yona. I will not give into this fear nor forsake my trust in you. Leave this place to you, my love. Oh. There's that sparkle in his eye. Up we go, Link, to the pillar of light. I shall blaze on ahead, my friend. <laughs> Hee hee. It seems Sidon has finally put his doubts behind him and returned to his usual fearless self i am so glad all the time he's been clean to regret over being unable to save his precious sister mipa my poor tormented sidon and to think he was unknowingly paralyzed paralyzed from taking action because he feared losing me as well Whoa. yet he has overcome this trial and placed his faith in me at last, the Sidon I know and love has come back to me. <laughs> Link, please take good care of my dear Sidon. He is the sun in my sky. Aww. Let's open this chest. Ooh, a royal claymore. What? Score, dude. All right. Uh, this episode is long enough. I'll see you guys next time. Peace out. Bye.